Hi everybody! Our first week is done! Yay! It was a blast seeing all your intro videos. <laughs> I really enjoyed it. I thought I would go with the glasses theme. These are my actual glasses. In the sun they turn into sunglasses. Um, but they're not staying with me for very long because my prescription changed and so I'm just waiting on my new glasses. And then I'll have actual sunglasses again. But I thought I'd give you a preview of what I look like with glasses because I do normally wear them but for distance so I don't normally have them when I'm with my computer. But the glare, it's kind of horrible so I'm going to take them off. First, we have absolutely no Slytherins on this channel. I don't know how we managed to do that because I feel like between Gryffindor and Slytherin, that's what most people put themselves with. It's not what most people are. A lot of people miscast, misplace uh, themselves in a house, but a lot of people like to put themselves in either Gryffindor or Slytherin because they're the ones that we know the most about, thanks to the books. And so I just think it's really funny that we have absolutely no Slytherins on this channel. Then, Dylan, I have written fanfiction. I'm actually halfway done with a one-shot right now. That's Rose Scorpius. And it's really pimp. It's written in second person from Scorpius's point of view. I love second person. It's my favorite way to write. Yeah, so I'm about halfway through with that. I have no idea if it'll get finished. So Zoe, my most prized Harry Potter possession, is definitely my wand. It's a hand-carved vine wand by Whirlwind Wand. And I'll link in the sidebar to his website. But I got it at Terminus last summer in August and it's gorgeous and I would show it to you guys right now but I'm at Robert's house instead of my own house because today is our one year anniversary. So I'm here instead but if you remind me I will show it to you in my next video. Okay so my pairings, <laughs> Dylan, a lot of them come from random fanfics that have side pairings with that or things that my friends wreck me means recommend by the way tell me if i start talking in fandom lingo and you don't understand because i will explain it but yeah so most most of the pairings i found through subplot in fan fiction and i'll link in the sidebar to a number of my favorites i'll keep it at a small number and i'll tell you what pairing is in what some of my more odd pairings such as ron pansy came from a subplot like um i think it was in a, a fic by cinnamon on fiction alley oh i don't remember the name name of it um but she had ron pansy as a subplot to draco harry in one of her fics um and she also She's the author that wrote A Beautiful World. I don't know if any of you guys have read it, but it's heart-wrenching. Oh, it's so good. I'll have to link to that one because I love it. She also writes really good Draco Ginny, so I'll link to that as well. She's one of my favorites. Other favorites, I don't know if I'll be able to find it, but if you guys ask for it, I can email you the um, PDF files of the Draco trilogy by Cassandra Clare. Cassandra Clare was a fanfic writer before she became a published writer. She currently is writing the, um, oh, what, what's her series called? She, was, she writes City of Bones, City of Ashes, um, what's her newest one? Uh, it's City of something. But she writes City of Bones and City of Ashes, which you can find in Borders. And she just had a third book come out, but, um, she wrote Draco Trilogy in fandom and it's fabulous it's like one of the classic fics it's mostly a general fic but it has um harry hermione which this is the only fic i'll read that in it has draco hermione slash draco Ginny, um but it's really good and if I can find the site that has the PDFs, I'll link to them. If not, if you want them, tell me and I will email them to you because I have all three PDFs. I haven't actually, I don't think I had Harry Seamus, but uh, I can dig it. I'm a fan. I will link to Eight Ways from Sunday, which has some Seamus Dean in it, which is like the cutest pairing ever. My absolute favorite Harry Draco fic. And the fic that I actually wrecked my friend Cammie and she fell in love with the pairing. 
is a fic called Dragon Tamer. It's on Fiction Alley. I'll link to it in the sidebar for sure. I believe it's rated R. It might be NC-17. I'm going to warn you that if you are any, any little bit squicked by same-sex pairings and possible same-sex sex scenes, you might want to cautiously stay away. But if you're not squicked by it, I highly recommend you to read it because it's so funny and so good. Draco has a house elf that's little and green and named Yoda, and Harry makes him say lines from the Star Wars movies. Like, it's hysterical. It's like the best fic ever. I think I've read it like 15 times. So yeah, so I'll link to a bunch of fics in the sidebar. You can read them at your own discretion. Squick, by the way, means like squeamish, um, or just, ah, uh, that's what it means, so you don't get really confused when I say squick. I am going to state for the record that I do not in any way encourage pairings that include Snape. I in no way feel that Snape should be put in sexual situations, and I do not believe that he has genitalia when it comes to that. Our intro. So, I kind I'm really digging the whole boxes swirling S for our song. I was thinking either part of Aaliyah's song that talks about Potter Tastic because I really like that part, or maybe a Wizard Rock song, or even us singing the Hogwarts School song. <laughs> I think would be really awesome, actually. Um, if everybody has Skype, I think we should maybe Skype chat about it, and then we can all, like, actually talk to each other. Or, if not, we can talk on AIM or MSN or whatever you guys have, because I have all of it. I just don't actively get on unless asked. Um, unless it's Gchat, I'm on that all the time. So let me know what messenger you have and we can talk about our intro. I will see you all on your respective days. You'll see me next week. And Dylan, it's your turn for a discussion question. Make it good. Bye.